Hello everybody, Joyce here with the Traveling Gamblers and I am here with John. Hello John. Hello Joyce. And John and I are on the Celebrity Summit and it is Port Day. So we are going to take this opportunity to record the casino for you. We're gonna go nice and slow and show you every machine and show you every table. There's music playing, so I'm going to do a voiceover and give you all the details. Here we go. Here we are walking into one of the three entrances to the casino. This is a little alcove in the back of the casino, and this is where they have their poker machines. There are actually some more in another alcove on the opposite side. And there are a couple of random machines out here as well. There's Buffalo Spirit and Kronos. Over here we have a Wonder Woman Gold and a Wonder Woman Wild. And behind here there are two other random machines that I have never seen or heard of. Silver Sword and Vampire's Embrace. These are all one cent denomination. And now walking into the actual main casino floor. Over here on the right, we have Gaucho's Gold. And then we have a row of Quick Hits. These are the Platinum Quick Hits. These are all a one cent denomination. And there are five of those. And on the left, there are two Golden Goddess. These are all one cent denomination games. There's two of those. And on the opposite side of that, we have Thundering Buffalo and the Charleston, both of which are one cent denomination as well. And over here we have two other random games, Paradise Garden and Something Horse, and those are one cent also. And this is a four bank of the same game. It's Fule Kele. There's two of them here and two on the other side here. And they each have their own individual grand jackpot as well as major, minor, and mini. And those are one cent denominations also. And this is one of the Siberian Storm and one Turtle Bay, one cent denomination. And over here we have a Plinko and wheels go round. One of the things that John and I noticed about this casino is there are a lot of individual slot machines like this one that we've never seen before and there's just one of that type of game. And then of course next to it, Hot Hot Habanero, we know that. And we know these very well, dancing drums. I feel like they have a lot of single individual older machines and they are just mixed in with some of the newer games. And here we have two of the Kronos, one cent denomination. And this is a perfect example of what I was speaking about. This row is just one of each different type of a machine. They're older games. Some of them we've heard of and some of them we haven't. There's Texas Tina, Hexbreaker, Nefertiti, Sea Monkeys, Kitty Glitter, and Wolf Run. Some of them I've played and some of them I've never heard of. If you haven't done so already, we invite you to subscribe to our channel. You just hit subscribe below this video and turn on the notification bell. That will let you know of any new videos that we post. Continuing on, we have two Wonder 4 Jackpot Boost games here. And on the opposite side of that are two of the Five Dragons Rapid game. John and I like to play these as well. Across from that, we have a Wheel of Fortune, 
with a $20,000 jackpot and a buffalo gold. And behind that, two more Wheel of Fortunes with the $20,000 jackpot. Those are the $1 denomination. And the Wheel of Fortune with a $10,000 jackpot. And those are also a $1 denomination. And on this side, we have one with a $20,000 jackpot and one with a $30,000 jackpot. Both of those are also the $1 denomination. Over here, we have three Supreme Dragon games. Each one has their own individual grand, major, minor, and mini jackpots. And next to that, we have five Dragons Gold, which is a little bit different than the five Dragons Rapid that we saw earlier. And two, Foo, Foo, Foo. They are multi-denomination games, so you can choose between one, two, and five cents. And these are the only two Buffalo Gold machines in the casino. And over here, there is a bank of four Double Blessings, which is a slightly different version of the dancing drums. They share a grand jackpot and a major jackpot, meaning if one of the machine hits it, then all four machines reset to the base number. And on the opposite side are four of the traditional dancing drums, and they also share the grand jackpot and the major jackpot. This is four quick hit machines. That one there that's blacked out is currently out of order. It has been the entire cruise. And on the other side, we have four individual games. There's only one of each of these in the casino. We have Playboy, Mercury, Wild Huskies, and Venus. And each one of those is a one penny or one cent denomination as well. Here in the center of the casino is the cashier's desk. And there are two cashiers when it's open to assist you. And around the corner over here, there's a little alcove with locket link. Along this wall, we have a few of the hold your hat locket link games, and they are multi-denomination. All of the locket link games are multi-denomination. And next to the hold on to your hat is three of the piggy banking machines and they are also multi-denomination and opposite them there's another wall there's another game here that it's looks like it's kind of one of those wonder four jackpots it has four different boards but i've never seen it before and next to that we have one single quick hit machine and mystic lamp Alakazam and Texas Tornado. Those are all one cent denomination games. Next to that, we have Queen Wild and Zeus Three Nautilus and Wild Stampede. Again, these are examples of some older games where they just have one machine of that game type in the casino. And turning around and coming up on the other side of the casino, straight ahead we have two more of the Kronos games. I like those, so does John. They're fun to play, and we usually have decent luck on them. And on the opposite side of Kronos, we have another Wheel of Fortune and a Dakota Thunder. The Wheel of Fortune is a $1 denomination. 
and these are two quick hits and these are the quick hit ultra pays the board expands when you get a bonus and those are one cent denomination as well and there's another wheel of fortune with the one dollar denomination with the twenty thousand dollar jackpot and a black widow there's a jackpot party and a Heidi slot machine village people and another jackpot party these are two of your definitely your older games and these two I don't know what they are I've never seen either one of them and I can't find a name on them but they are one cent denomination Jin Feng is this tall one here in front of me and I don't know what the other the name of the other game is that's next to it if anybody knows comment below oh here's another one on this side so here's another one of these oh this is Jin Hu the one on the other side was Jin Feng this is Jin Hu and I don't know what this game is with this happy looking fellow I have no idea what the name of that is and these I call these babies. John and I call these babies. And a lot of other people do too. I don't know what the actual name is of them. But they're one cent. And these are the Sphinx 3D. There's two of those. And this is a row of older real slot machines. And these are the sevens and the stars and things like that. And they are all one cent denomination. And there are no two games alike. They all have different kinds of jackpots. But there's only one of each kind. And that leads us to the other poker room on the other side. So this is similar to the one where we first walked in to the casino. These are your other poker slot machines in the casino. So they're either in this room or the one where we first walked in at the beginning of the tour of the casino. And there's two of the Supreme Dragon. We saw a couple of those on the other side as well. And again, they are the one cent denomination games. And we have a couple of the Money Grab, Crazy Money 2, and two of the Money Roll. And they are also one cent denomination. And back into the casino on the main floor, there's your ATM machine for your convenience. The fees are quite high on those ATM machines. And then these are some of the older machines as well, where they just have one of each type. Sea Tales, Winter Wolf, Wild Shootout, and Fairy's Fortune. This is two more of the Wheels Go Round. We saw one of those earlier on on the other side. One cent denomination. And on the opposite side of that are two more Wheels Go Round games. I've never played this, but there's five of them in this casino. And again, we have a row of these individual older style games. We have Tornado, Texas, Crown Jewels, Wild Rainforest, and Ringy Dingy Reels. If any of you have ever heard of any of these games, comment below and let us know if you've ever played any of them either. Smoking Hot Devils, Haunted House, Lotteria, and Chameleon. Now, Lotteria I have seen before, but I've never seen any of the others before. Wild Leopard, Fortune Coin, I played a fortune coin game in Las Vegas and it was absolutely awful. 
I didn't win anything. It was terrible. It was absolutely terrible. I hope somebody else plays it has good luck. John and I have actually played these M Magic Link and we both really liked them. We we did pretty well on them as well. And Hawaiian Luau. Again, one of those one-off machines that I have never seen or heard of. And then this is a bank of three of the treasure ball slot machines. And all three machines share a jackpot of the Supreme and the Maxi. And moving on to the table games, I will show you the game and whatever payouts or rules there are at each table. Truth be told, I don't know that much about card games. I've played blackjack and I've played roulette and craps, but card games, poker, I really don't know anything about. I do want to give a shout out to my friend Nancy, who has helped guide me on some tips on what the important things are to show. So I do my best to try and show everything that I think that matters. So hopefully you'll see whatever it is that you're looking for as far as the rules and the odds and things of that nature. And here's another three card poker. They've got a few of those. They are the payouts and the minimums, maximums, and the antis. And moving on to Texas Hold'em, the ultimate Texas Hold'em, I should say. I don't know if there's a difference. And there are the trips and the blind. and the play bet. I really don't know of any idea what any of that means, but I'm again trying to show you everything that I think is important. And the craps table actually I do know. So there's your field, your pass line, and your come bets, and there are your odds on your hard ways. And here's another blackjack table. This is Lucky Ladies and it has a side bet. If you get 20 in your first two cards, they have some additional payouts for those. I have had some people ask me about blackjack on the cruise ships and whether or not they pay three to two or six to five. And it looks like on these tables, they pay six to five. And there you go. Yeah, it says it right there on the bottom. Blackjack pays six to five. And we have, this is the single deck blackjack table I believe yes ten dollar minimum three three hundred dollar maximum and as you know those can change the minimums and the maximums can change throughout the cruise and there are the payouts And we just have a couple more tables to show you. And this is another Lucky Ladies with that side bet. And this one is a $25 minimum with a $500 maximum bet per hand. And I'm just gonna swing around and show you that is the casino bar. The summit has been completely renovated and it's absolutely beautiful. There is your Texas Hold'em table and there's a full shot of the bar. And 
They have a couple large screen TVs up there for some sporting events that they televise on the ship. And I'm just going to give you one quick pan around the casino and show you the entire floor. And at this time, I would like to say thank you so much for watching. We truly appreciate your support. And as always, we hope you have a wonderful day.